Space. Hello. Please adjust your volume. Uh. Okay. Um. Up. Sure. Turn that down. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Please set your resolution. Uh, yeah, that's, uh... Nice one. Please select your favorite rock. This one. Thank you. You are ready. Your one sole objective. Get to the core. All right, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of uh, Play Random Games and see what happens. Uh, today we're playing To the Core. It's a well, I don't really know what it is. I suppose it's an incremental game, uh, mining-based. And here we are. We are traveling to a planet. Strange. Hmm. Train roughness ten. Fuel per second one. Hey. All right. Yeah. So it's. Oh, I can move. Gotcha. So I'm collecting iron right now. I gotta go down though, but my fuel is pretty low. Not really sure what. Oh! Cap! Shop. Funky fresh beats. Uh, what are you? Drill damage. Or extraction. Increased drop rates of blocks. Fuel tank. Silicone plating. I don't have silicone. I don't have any iron or silicone. Could get a fuel tank, I suppose. Or orange or extraction. Um That costs money. I have no money. I could get money. Cool. Chill damage. Ooh, tech trees. Interesting. I don't have enough for that, though. Yeah, so I guess this is... This is just the game. It jumped us straight into it. Uh, no backlog, no... World building. Um, I think to start with, we probably want the very top layer. Um, because that's giving us some iron. Not like a ton or anything. Um, but it seems to use the least amount of fuel. Um, I seem to have a multiplier too. So I think the quicker we get resources, the higher that multiplier goes up. Cool. So I th think the idea is just to kind of grind the first level a few hundred times and then um and then do upgrades so a pretty bog standard um incremental game as far as that's concerned um like i've i've seen some like pictures and like some uh some other gameplay of it like it it gets kind of crazy but you know, everything's edited nowadays, so it's like, it's so hard to tell how long that actually takes. So, I just upgraded ore extraction. Oh, ooh, bah. Um, I probably want to increase fuel. I don't know what that is. Okay. 
Probably increase fuel a few times. Can't seem to click on those ones. The sun? Oh, I can, I can go to the sun. I would certainly die. There's, n there's no way going to the sun is a good idea right now. Okay, so I seem to definitely be making, getting ore faster now. And my fuel doesn't seem to be wasted, so doing something right, I suppose. The real question is, can I prevent myself from bouncing too much? Let's just, let's just farm this out a little bit and then buy more upgrades. So I believe this is a relatively newer game. Um, Probably should have had my talking points ready today. Massey, Mastery Unlock 2. Oh, interesting. So there's skill trees. I mean, of course, they're like skill trees. Or, I suppose tech trees and skill trees are two completely different elements, huh? But it seems to have both. Plus 5% multiplier for drops, 1% less durable. Okay, so does this go away if... No. This stays, okay. That's good enough. Oh, that costs iron, doesn't it? This costs money. I'll increase my drill damage a bit. Hopefully, we can actually see the difference there. Hard to tell. The number is bigger, though, so that's something. So, we're getting iron right now. Um, from what I've seen, I believe the yellow layer is silicone. So, in order to get a lot of the upgrades, we need to go get that. But that's so far away. I seem to be able to move left and right, but the up and down really don't seem to do much, if anything. Let's see how low can we can go. I'm not even sure if I'll fit. Ooh. We might be able to- oh. It just explode. I'm not even sure if we got that. No, we did not. Definitely did not. Um, let's get more fuel. Let's get... Honestly, we should probably just bank on ore extraction. Right, because like, the faster we can get ore, the faster we can upgrade. All around good. Of course, the more upgrades we get, incrementally that builds on itself, so the more difficult the next level of upgrade will be. Which is okay. So we did upgrade our fuel reserves. I'm not sure if we're even able to get that silicone yet. Because I still had fuel when I when I touched it the last time and just completely exploded. Let's do this one more time. This does feel a little bit repetitive. Um, I might just uh, do a jump cut here in a second here. I got my first silicone at least. Okay, definitely found a new meta, so it's 
You just gotta dig low enough to trap yourself underground. And then just spam yourself against the wall. Oh, not like that. Okay, look at what what can we buy? What can we do? I mean, ore extraction, right? I mean, we have we have 12 silicon. Uh, we could do more ore extraction. I think that's probably the best, right? Coin siphon. Siphon a percentage of coins from blocks. That's that's really good. That costs money. Okay, okay. Oh. See if we can do that again where I kind of Ooh, got a new mastery. Three. Just hit restart. Ooh. that siphon so let's just sell all the silicone to sell all that can I there's more unlocks okay we at least have level one siphon though so we're gonna get some coins for blocks I don't know how many probably not a lot but some Oh yeah, money go up. Money's actually going up pretty fast. I mean, not like fast fast, but like a lot faster than I was expecting. Okay, let's see where we are right now. Increase siphon probably. Um, we're pretty close to the next milestone without even spending our coins or our uh, resources. Hmm. Do we have 4k worth of goodies? I feel like fuel is probably like the biggest detriment to our uh, progress right now. Silicone plating, yeah, I don't have silicone. So yeah, let's let's aim for silicone. So that means we need a better drill. Huh? Maybe. Let's see, let's sell that much. Ooh. Gravity lock. Toggle shift to not get knocked back when you break a block. Hmm. And then that requires silicone. So let's upgrade the tank a bit. Um, and since we're here, what else can we do? Can't do more ore extraction. Can't do that. That requires silicone. So let's sell the rest of what we have. And then we can't do another siphon.
honestly, the gravity lock is pretty good. Just straight down. And like, for the most part, we're just getting the top layer anyway. So if we're talking just straight aggression, I think this is probably like the best perk that we have right now. It seems like the deeper that we go, the more fuel we use. So maybe if I just... Yeah, if I just eat off the surface here, I think that probably gives us the most per run, right? I mean, not that it really matters a ton, because every time that we blow up, we can just restart super quickly. Yeah, but that gravity lock is just kind of overpowered, honestly. I still really can't get silicone, though. I don't know if I'd need a, a better drill or or what, because that hull upgrade requires silicone. Can we upgrade anything else? Or refine increased drop rates of blocks. Wow. May as well, right? And if we can get more coin siphon. Let's see, that's pretty much fully unlocked. Silicone plated drill. Increased drill damage. Yeah, let's do that a couple- oh, I need more silicone. Probably increase my tank as well. Oh, I can do silicone plating. Oh, that's good. I think... I think we're on to something here. We can get silicone now. Still not very well though. We can do it. Yeah, we're just getting tiny, tiny bits of silicone every every life. I mean, I say tiny bits, but like, that's almost, that was like 200 silicone right there. Not the worst, not the worst. I'm thinking we do this a couple more times and we can probably get some silicone armor and then we can probably actually mine this place out. It really just seems to be an issue with um, the damage that we're taking as we go deeper. Okay. So what do we have here? Can we get this? No, we can't do that. Silicone plating. Yeah, let's buy... Let's buy a few of those. Where's this one? Recover percentage of block health as fuel. Aluminum. I don't even... I don't even know what aluminum looks like. Or refine. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's do another coin siphon. Silicone plate a drill. Yeah. And then fuel tank size plus plus. 
We haven't even finished the fuel tank plus. Well, one cost iron, one cost silicone. So I'll do both. Yeah, why not? Oh, we are just... We're not really taking any uh, damage. Or um, fuel usage, I suppose. Yeah, it's really just the silicone that's doing us in right now. So... Oh yeah, look at that. I can like actually just mine out all of this. Costs like nothing. I think I'm faster with the gravity lock on. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> you know, this is, uh, it's such a simple game, but like it's. It hits that good part of your brain, you know? Kind of like the instant gratification, watch some... Watch big number go up. Just feels good. Spin. What if I spin? Well, that seems to work. Ooh, got a silicone mastery. Drop multiplier plus five percent. Okay. Oh, we're just absolutely chewing through this rock. do what can we do could upgrade the drill a couple times Ooh, what are you thrusters allows you to fly by using up and down keys still don't know what aluminum is it costs too much but we have the silicone so what if uh we sell all of our iron. Then we run out of silicone. Gotcha. Um, increase. No more iron. Increase our fuel. Um, increase our siphon a little bit. Increase that. Um, what else can we buy? That Ice. Hmm. Interesting. Actually, oh, we can actually mine silicone now. Oh, aluminum. Aluminum's the red stuff. Who guessed that? so immersed in the game I keep on forgetting to talk. It's definitely one of those games that you can just 
kind of shut off your brain and and enjoy. I don't know if that makes sense to any of you, um, but that's 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 how this makes me feel, I suppose. Just just a good game, and our money seems to be going up pretty steadily too. I don't know if that was because of the recent um, drill upgrade allowing us to break more blocks, or if probably a combination of that and the siphon, honestly. Well, we are just cruising now. And then again, there are other planets. Um, so if I had to imagine, this is going to be easy as cake, and then we're going to go to the next planet, and it's just going to be completely impossible. Okay, last run. I actually just kind of want to see how much iron I can get. I'm definitely just uh, circumnavigate the, the entire planet. Or asteroid. It's probably just an asteroid. They say planet, but I don't think it's quite big enough. Uh, I don't have thruster, so I can't really go up once I'm down here. I can kind of backtrack, but that's about it. But even then, it's kind of iffy. Yeah. Kind of on a one-way streak here. Um, what else can we do? Could increase our hull, and then just go straight for the, uh, the next thing. Aluminum. upgrade our drill for the last time and then I'm thinking upgrade the hull a couple times quite a, quite a couple times upgrade fuel tank and then get back at it now with any luck we should be able to start making a dent in the uh, aluminum there Well, we're definitely destroying the silicone pretty quickly. Yeah. We're, we're getting there, but it's... It's still a lot of damage. Or, uh, fuel usage, I suppose. Aluminum mastery. Interesting. Lots of exploding. Uh, I swear you die more times in this game than you do in Dwarf Fortress. I mean, you sure do get masteries pretty quickly once you really start going at it. Um, on. We can get the aluminum drill at least once. a little bit more damage. I think we're doing 60-something before, now we're doing 72. Now the whole point, I believe, is to make it to the core, so that big old yellowy white ball right there. Yeah, definitely not going to be able to make it. Not yet, at least. But as soon as we do make it to the core, I believe we can unlock more planets. Um, because of course, you know, this one's I think done for. Um, actually, I'm not 100% sure. I'm just kind of, uh, 
Assuming, I suppose. Another aluminum mastery. They seem to be coming in pretty quickly. I wonder if uh, you get masteries quicker if it's a more difficult resource. So I don't think I got um, silicone or iron mastery that consistently. Maybe I did. Maybe I did. Thinking we grab the rest of this aluminum and then head back to the shop one last time and see if uh, see if we can upgrade our drill probably. I think a few good drill upgrades we should be able to make it to the core. Oh, I forgot to go back. I'm just kind of stuck down here. Cool. Ooh, what's this? Lens enhancer. Adds a laser on your drill equipment. 80,000 silicone and gunpowder. I don't even know what gunpowder is. I don't have quite enough to upgrade that anymore. Let's get the thrusters. Ooh. Shockwave. Cause an explosion when you're going fast. Don't have gunpowder. Don't have rock, don't have sulfur. It's fully upgraded, so is that. Let's see. Can't afford that. Can upgrade that once, upgrade that once. Still don't have rock. Can upgrade the hull a little bit though. Ooh, regen. Yeah, I'll do regen. Honestly, we might be able to just go to the core now. Yeah, let's let's do it. We win 85 damage now, almost 86. And we're really not taking much damage at all. Uh, we're taking enough though. Oh, but the silicone can heal us enough to where that doesn't really matter anymore. Yeah. So then let's go back here. Try and drill this out a little bit more. Ooh. Retreat. Some of this iron is not regenerating quite as much as I would like it to. Honestly, I believe the silicone was regenerating me a lot more. Yeah. So it seems the more valuable the resource, the more it uh, regenerates the fuel. Which, you know, makes sense. Oh, the thrusters were such a good buy. Okay, let's try and make it back to that hole that we were starting there. Just kind of see if I can top off just a little bit more here. I don't think we'll be able to make it through this. Oh. 
No, no. Oh, we can eat through these pretty quickly. Um, we do have thrusters on right now. It doesn't seem to be uh, very easy to control because it's just up and down. Um, and it doesn't seem to matter which direction I'm pointing in. Like, up is up no matter what. But right here looks like it's a little bit thinner. I'm wondering if I can crack through this. No, it's... Still just a couple upgrades away, really. But on the plus side, since we're eating through the silicone and the iron so fast... Um, after this run here, we should be able to go to the shop. Uh, hopefully buy another couple upgrades and get to that core. Really banking on the idea right now that silicone is more valuable, so we could probably get most of the upgrades that we want, I would imagine are either silicone or aluminum based. And seeing how iron and silicone really don't hurt us at all, we actually gain more fuel mining them than not. Um, the real challenge is still just the aluminum right now. Okay, shop. Uh, can we, we can do a drill upgrade. We can do one drill upgrade. Um, can we do armor upgrade? We cannot fuel. We can do one. Hmm. Not much anything else though. We can do... Oh, we can do a couple more siphons. Siphon plus plus. Okay, yeah, let's uh, sell all of that. Let's... Mm, I don't think I'm ready to part with all my silicone yet. But another couple siphons should go a long way. Ah. Back up. Uh, we're taking too much damage. Yeah, silicone seems to be our best friend right now. Uh, we really don't get much at all for the iron um, as far as fuel goes. Um, so it, I think we should just get all of the silicone, like all of the silicone, um, and then try again for that hole. Hopefully we can make a dent. I kind of doubt we can make it to the core of this run. Um, I'm gonna keep on trying, of course. Well, okay, okay, if we can get a full tank again, we might be able to break through that hole and touch the core. I assume the core will hurt us immensely. We are looking good on money too. This is about as much as we're gonna get, so 
Make one final approach. See, how much fuel do we have? 22.9, 23. Yeah, iron is really kind of um, at that equilibrium mark. Like, oh, it's, it's so close to equilibrium. Be it. That might be it. Oh. Oh, that's it. I just want to touch it. I did it though. <laughs> I touched it. I don't know if I got anything out of it though. But I can now fairly efficiently mine silicone or uh, aluminum. So let's try and get as much of this as we can. I can't even read that number. Times a thousand? We seem to have a, quite a bit. Yeah, I don't think I'm collecting anything from that. Acid coating. I'm not sure what the sulfur is. Haven't found it yet. Upgrade that a bit. I have no idea how many times I have to hit the core in order to explode it. Oh. It's a good drill. Yeah, I mean, right now the core is still a one hit kill. Um, we're definitely. We're definitely getting closer. I don't know how close. I have no idea. It got smaller though. Like it like it gets smaller when you hit it. I don't know if that means anything. As much as this as we can. Just gonna go straight for the aluminum. I believe all the hub, the, the 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 words words are hard. All of the uh, hall upgrades that I want right now, I believe, are primarily aluminum based. 
So if we can get two, maybe three more uh, hull upgrades, we should be able to actually get somewhere. accidentally hit the core, but I'm really flirting with it here. Yeah, so one, two, three. Oh, that was three. Hmm. Maybe I just hold on to those for now. Okay, so I upgraded a little bit. Maybe I can touch it. Just just once without exploding. Really all I want. Well, it's not. Uh, I had so much health. And now I don't. Uh get this so efficiently though. Oh, the music's just a bop though. I don't know if you're listening to this too, but it's just... I mean, it's repetitive. So is the game. But like, it's just... It's fitting, you know? Yeah, we have like unlimited fuel here. Like we can, we can just collect everything for days. I don't even know if we need iron anymore. I mean, if nothing else, it sells, right? Yeah, I, I don't think I can hit the core. Even though I have full health. Oh. Oop. Turn off gravity lock for a second. Ah! There's no way that's going to be enough. Here in my mouth. Gross. Yeah, I don't even know if I need to buy these fuel upgrades either. I'm buying everything just for the sake of buying things. That's what I need. I need the next drill. What am I doing? So, let's go back to the core. Let's get all of the aluminum. And then let's just upgrade our drill, because that should... I mean, it's gonna benefit us one way or another. It's gonna benefit us one way or another. I'm not sure how much of a difference it's really gonna make, though. Like, if we're being one tapped by the core every single time, at full health, you know, it's like... Is a better drill gonna do much? 
And, like, we need hull upgrades, but, like, really can't, can't really afford me. close actually. Honestly, one drill upgrade? That might be enough. Twenty out of twenty, don't have that. Can't afford that. Strict boards. Hmm. Don't know what a rock is. Yeah, sure, more money. Give me more money. Siphon expander. That's a lot of money. 900 mil. A day's work, right? Increased drop rates of locks. Cool. We might be able to hit the core. I mean, we, like, we hit it last time and survived, so... Okay. Prestige Planet, uh, times three block health, times three resource. Prestige. Okay. Okay, so, same rock, but more resource. Okay, so cores are, is at one now. I see, I see. Well, you know, made it to the core. I did it. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. Um, I'm not sure if I will play this game again. Depends on you. If I get enough likes, if I get enough traction on this video, if if you guys tell me this is what you want to watch, I'll make more content. Um, but otherwise, if you made it this far, thank you so much. Like, it truly means a lot. Um, at the day of recording this, I've, I'm at 98 subscribers. Um, it's really kind of astonishing, and I appreciate every single one of you. Um, yeah, so all the normal stuff, uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good night.